Oh, this guy's running towards us. There we go, guys. Just like that, and then the boss will spawn. So let's kill the boss now. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Kabutops here, and today I'm bringing you another Star Citizen video. You guys want to make hundreds of thousands of dollars in AUEC plus getting armor? This is the guide you need. So if you want to get really cool looking armor that's going to make you look sick, stand out from the, the crowd, and it's awesome, follow this guide. First things first, guys, you are going to have to have a certain reputation with Microtech, okay? Or uh, if you do Hurston, but Microtech is the easiest. You need the Junior Security Contractor. I have a video for that down in the description if you would like to understand how to unlock this super fast. It takes less than 30 minutes. But basically, if you guys don't want to watch the video, you just go to the Mercenary tab and go to the uh, Copion missions, the Wildlife Control Copions. And there's a certain area you have to go to, so make sure to check out the video and, and figure that out. But guys, we are going to be doing the Mercenary missions for Apprehend Bounty Travis McKinney. Okay, or any of these. So basically, these uh, high-risk targets or these uh, medium-risk targets or whatever they are. Yeah, it's high-risk. I'm pretty sure it's just only high-risk. This is where we have to go to the distribution centers so that we can actually kill these guys. So right here, they're at a work center on Microtech. And all you have to do is you have to kill like 20 dudes or whatever and then he'll finally spawn in so my recommendation guys for gear coming into this is just gear uh bring a bunch of meds so make sure you have like three or four on your hip and then bring an extra like one or two i might even need i guess i don't have any more meds but bring enough meds guys to where if you get shot you can heal up Bring weapon and then bring mags that fill up your armor. So just have as much ammo as you can. And if you want to take the bodies, use the multi-tool. But the best thing about these missions, guys, is that they have a local tab of inventory. So just like this. So what that means is you can drag the armor and everything of theirs into the local tab. And just get on your ship and just instantly put everything on your ship. So guys, let me go to this mission over there to eliminate the hostiles. And you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Well, look at that. I got three things in there. Taking up space. Let me show you guys right now. Okay, guys. As we approach, you'll see that there are a lot of ships here. And I'm talking a lot. Not all of them are players, but some of them are. A lot of them are just ships that spawn here with their stuff open. So that you can just grab them and leave with these kind of things in case your ship explodes or whatever. So all we have to do is just fly to these areas. They look really cool, and I wish you could see it during the day. But basically, there are just spots to land. Let me disable that. Oh, I'm flying really fast. And get my landing gear out. We're going to just land here next to where these ships are. And I think this should be a decent spot. There are, like I said, a lot of ships, guys. But it's not going to really stop you from being able to do the missions. Don't worry. There's an entrance point right here. Oh, Let's fly and make sure that we kind of land at least a little straight. But as you can see right there, that looks pretty dang good. We power off the ship with I. Not you, but I. Just so that we could, you know, make sure... It's landed all the way. And just be careful, guys. Um, The FPS will drop here a little bit. But that's okay. It's fine. Like, no big deal. Um, It's Star Citizen, after all. So let me reload my gun. And get into here. So, make sure you do not shoot anybody that is pink. There will also even be some guys in pink armor. Do not shoot them, okay? That will instantly give you, like, a crime stat 3 got one once and some guy came over to try and kill me as a bounty heart target like it was actually terrible we have to eliminate the hostiles and usually it's in like one big room so just keep making your way over to wherever it is i'm gonna go through the door over here 
Oh uh, no, these are just regular doors. So we just keep making our way through these small ones. Sorry guys, I forgot. It's the small doors. And then eventually you'll get to it. So just use these small doors. But there's going to be people here now. So let's get for real busy guys. And uh, start blasting some dudes. You see there's already some dead people here that have been looted. This is a good guy. You see, this is scary because look, you almost could kill him. This guy's wearing pink, so you do not shoot him. Someone get eyes on this slippery bastard now. This guy's not pink though, so he's supposed to be shot. And look at these guys. Look at this. They're wearing some sick armor. Purple arms with like cool things, guys. I'm telling you right now, like this is how you get some cool sets. And some of the workers like actively try to help you guys so that's really cool but just be careful not to shoot them it, it'll ruin your entire time and it's not worth it it's pretty sad sometimes it's a little dangerous for me to be walking towards the exact center guys just because this is where a lot of them could spawn pink guy see that it almost got techie there behind me but i didn't see him to the left here he just threw a nade somewhere oh my god and there's more over here is that pink okay not pink okay good i started shooting first and then realized i was like i need to check so these guys just take a couple shots to the head so it's not really that hard look we already have only five left I'll come back and show you guys exactly where all the gear is. We're going to come up here. Usually they're up here as well. Yeah, see how there's three up there? You just walk up the stairs in like the middle area and then you can pull up to them right here. That's two of them. Three. And then can we see him from here? Or no, I guess not. We'll eliminate these other two dudes. I think we have to go up the other part of the stairs. Oh, this guy's running towards us. This guy's gonna be aggroed on us. Probably gonna be decent. Nice, just like that. That guy's a really cool helmet. That is a very rare armor. And then we run over here. And we run up the stairs, and then we have to kill him. There we go, guys. Just like that, and then the boss will spawn. So let's kill the boss now. Okay, guys, you won't see this in the video due to editing and stuff, but I really, really had to go do something real quick. So I just got back to my thing. I literally let it, like, sit here for, like, eight minutes. So if any of the loot is gone, I am sorry. But yeah, basically... After you kill everybody, it will spawn the boss. But not really like the boss, it's just the the HRT. It's the guy. And so you'll get your 34k or 40k, whatever it was. And you'll get your cool set of armor from this dude. He looks like a, a stormtrooper guy. Like kind of like um like the death troopers or whatever. So let me show you guys the fastest way to loot in this game. What you're going to do is you're going to press the swap view button after opening loot. And it's going to... Okay, guys, let me show you the fastest way to loot in the game. At the top right, you just press this open inventory button, and you go to the local tab. Then, I mean, look at that, guys. That, that freaking helmet's sick. Okay, guys, and all you have to do after opening that is you go to the local tab, and you grab this guy's undersuit, and just drag it in. That's going to drag everything but the gun. Then you do the gun. Uh, sorry about that. Look at that. I This is the loot from the other run that I did. But that's it. Okay? It's super easy, guys. Like, it's it's not only the easiest way to loot, but it's the fastest, and you get everything. So, let's uh, keep doing it. So, every single guy that we can find, you just open inventory and drag from the undersuit into your local tab. And then you grab his gun. That, makes, that ensures, guys, that you're grabbing the meds, you're grabbing the extra magazines, 
you're grabbing every single thing that this guy has on him, including his armor. I mean, these armor sets are dope. And you're just taking it. It's that easy. These Spec Ops dudes are uh, no match for us with the AR and uh, a looting technique. You know what I'm saying? So let's keep going on these dudes. Oh, this is a sick piece of armor, guys. Yeah, I'm going to get myself decked out after this. Because this is freaking awesome. Okay, guys, even sometimes the guards can die. I didn't shoot them, but the other thing did. So now look at that. Now I got a, f a full pink set of armor. And uh, more of these S71 rifles. Those are really good rifles, by the way. Oh, check this out. There's a green set here, too. I mean, look at this, guys. We're going to have freaking every set that we need. Green, red, purple, blue, yellow, everything. Like, it's it's a freaking good day to be us. I mean, look, as I said, yellow and green right there. It's a green and yellow set. And then we're going to have nades. I mean, these helmets are really cool. We're... Okay, that's the pink guy. Okay, I got scared for a second that that guy was going to try and kill us. But it was not a bad guy. It's a good guy. We're fine. Yeah, let's grab these, dude. These are some of my favorite sets right here. Just these uh, these red and white and gray and stuff. I mean, these helmets are freaking crazy, too. This looks like better than some of the paid armor sets that uh, people, people buy and stuff. Really want to loot this guy because this guy looks sick. Hopefully. Nice, nice. I was going to say, usually his is like kind of bad. Okay, cool. And then grab that shotgun. And then we'll go up here. We don't have to loot the rest of the uh, things. Oh, I don't know why it's not loading. At least we have like an AR now. Okay. That should be it, guys. That's basically everything looted. I mean, there might be, like, a little more. Uh, there might be the bodies to the left. But they probably have despawned already since, you know, clutter and such. Leg armor, something's glitched up right there, and I'm not going to mess with it. Sometimes those boxes are just not something you guys want to mess with. Okay. Over here is the way that we came in. I think it was over this way since the ship's over there. So... You just try to find which area your, your ship is located in and just run back there. Someone brought this ship in. Is that a Nursa or no? That's Oh, that's just the ship you use the boxes with. That's pretty cool. Someone brought that in. Like, look at that. They drove that in so they can um, they can carry more gear and stuff. But I guess they just didn't know that there's a local tab you could use. Okay, guys, I'm pretty dumb. I, uh, I went the wrong way again. Now... Going to the exterior cargo, I should be getting back to the ship after this door. I think it takes us to the exit. That is my bad. And yeah, that's the outside. Cool. So let me show you guys exactly what to do to get your loot loaded into the back of your ship so you can take it home. Rich and new with all your new cool armor sets and everything. So let's close the door and we check it out by pressing I to open the inventory and we go to vehicles and then it has all of our local tab. If we press move all, I don't think it'll work. Uh, why does it say the vehicle is full? It's not full. So I just pressed move all guys and it put like everything in here and we're going to look at undersuits. Like how many undersuits do we have? We have that many undersuits, which means there's that many pieces of gear. Uh, and then it's not letting us fit this one in. Which I'm kind of confused about. I think what's happening is with uh, these big weapons that I have or whatever that I found on a uh, another mission that I was doing are just taking up too much space. I'm going to throw them out, and if they... Uh, didn't matter and that's not what's causing the bug then i'll just have to load them back in you know not too big of a deal so let's go to vehicles local and see okay yeah it doesn't let us but that's okay guys we already have a bunch of those sets so that's totally fine so guys as soon as you finish and you get everything loaded in 
uh, as you saw how easy that is. You just hop in your ship and go to whatever spaceport you live at or anything like that. And we're going to go trade it to the local tab there. So make sure you fly safe and do not explode because this is the part of the journey where if you die, you lose all that cool gear that you guys just got. And that would not be a fun time. So what I would suggest doing is um, enabling your quantum drive, spooling it, and just flying directly straight up. That way you can get away as fast as you can. And it's just going to be easier and just smarter to do so. And just like that, guys, we're flying out of the area with all of our new cool loot. So let's try this out. You open F2, and I want to be put. I want to put everything at Port Tressler. So all I'm gonna do is set a course for Port Tress, uh, Port Tressler, and I'm gonna jump there, and I'll see you when I get there. Okay, guys, loads of people here at Port Tressler, but oh my gosh, let's just get into Anger One, and I'll show you exactly what you need to do to put your gear up. If you've never done it before, it's really simple overshot that a little bit let's throw our landing gear up so we don't speed in too fast now all you have to do is you jump out your seat as soon as you walk over right here just press i and go to your vehicle tab and just press move all and that's like absolutely everything the, the ship is still bugged saying like i had stuff but there's no undersuits oh there's armor sorry suits clothing weapons move all utility i could just unclick it all and just press move all there we go and yeah that's literally everything i mean it looks really cluttered now because it didn't stack any of the meds which sucks but when you want to go to stuff you just press i and go to like under suits and yeah guys that's how you get legendary like rare armor sets and things like that so that you can uh look cooler than all of your friends and how you can also just uh, sell all those armors if you would like. You could go to the stores and sell things like that. But yeah, guys, I hope that you uh, enjoy this video. And thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure if you want to enter the giveaway uh, where we're giving away 1 million AOEC, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment your IGN down below. You have to uh, comment your IGN and be subscribed. I will be checking. So good luck to you guys. And thank you so much for watching. And as always, guys, adios.